Hey guys, what's going on? here today. We're going to be playing some more Farming Simulator 2019 here on the server, on the tournament server. And we got most everything pretty much done. We do have to clean up for the cows, but we got them pretty much all fed and all of that. They need some more, they need water, which we're going to get right now. Straw can wait. Same with horses. I went ahead and rode them all this morning. Got them all rode. They're at like 23, mainly 20s and all that but we do have three million now we're gonna jump in the semi and we'll go out and get some water it's just out there probably drive down right here or hit the tree actually I'll probably drive down and around because this is only a, a true semi I should say it's an only well I think we can make it yeah we made it as long as you got speed you can make it but we're gonna get this filled up to like 10,000 I think I don't want to overfill it but we'll fill it up to like a few thousand so I'm thinking around 8,000 I think that'll probably be good like I said I want to end up empty so that we have some milk to sell I think we might sell some today or we might wait for a full load we'll see probably have probably wait till a full load I don't know how much this holds but I know it holds a lot holds probably a good amount we only have 8,000 milk, so basically this is all we'd be taking into town. We might as well wait till we can fill it up and wait till the prices are good. So we'll drive around back, and basically you just have to unload it. You just drive around back here, and looks like there's like lime or something. There's something glitching out right there. Don't know what it is. It's weird. Looks like they've been using that water trailer. That's an actual water trailer. This one holds water too. Um, looks like we got 26,000. Not bad. 26,000 full of water. We might actually buy some more cows. Let me know if we should. Because I sure can buy a few more. Um, we can. I think we can go up to like 100. I'm going to look to see how many we actually can get. Um, we have a lot of fence built. In different spots. Here's our cow pasture. So we can fit 200 and we can buy 16 horses. Probably not a total of 16 horses. We're actually just going to park this semi here. Or actually we do need it today for the trailers and stuff. Um, let's see, did I do that mission? Did I get it? Yeah, okay. So I did two missions. I did field 4 and I did field 17. Fertilized that field. Planted that field. And yeah, Spencer's on here. He's up there buying cows, buying some animals or something like that. We're going to, um, let's see, what do we got to do? I think I might sell some grain, a little bit of grain. Um, not a whole lot. I might actually harvest. That's what I'll probably do. So I think we'll probably, let's see, can we just unload it? Not really. I think we'll unhook it somewhere, like right here. Pull forward. We'll go ahead and hook onto the other trailers. We'll take, I don't know what we could take into town. I think we'll just take a load into town and kind of mess around. And then if you guys do want to go check out the other channel, my channel, I'll be posting a harvest video on there. We'll be harvesting our land. And today we'll just kind of mess around with some stuff. We might actually start harvesting. I don't know yet. Go ahead and close that. So this is a triple trailer setup thing. Um, I don't know what we're going to haul. We'll go ahead and look here in a second. What we'll haul. But yeah, this is the tournament map. It's on Honeydew Farms. It's it's uh, Master Farmers Tournament. We got all these people on here. Green team, blue team, blue team squad, purple's obviously Spencer, red's Master. This is us. This is SF. Not sure who that is. Or admin maybe. And this is, this is police, I think. This is king. And, yeah. So, I'm going to kind of look at the prices, see what we need to haul, and haul it where. Somebody said central grain don't work, which kind of sucks because it's high priced everywhere. And I might haul some beans. We'll see. All right, so I think we are going to haul some soybeans in. We're going to go up to central grain to see if it works. Somebody said it doesn't work. But I'm going to go ahead, up and try it anyway. And then if not, we'll go to port grain which is a little ways away we don't have soybeans in this one it's in the other bins I'm not sure why we did bins like this maybe they got full or something not sure 
on that like I said I just jumped in here and am helping them out so we do have to trade that back combine off because it's gonna get to 30 hours this next time around oh I hate when like the uh, when that button sticks when reverse sticks kind of sucks so there's 30 30,000 that ain't a whole lot yeah 30,000 we could put it all in a truck actually we might leave the back hopper to the house because we can fit it all in here oh oh they have separate hoppers I wonder if the front hopper is big or bigger than the others we'll see we'll back it up because right now this this back hopper looks small wonder if it'll hold oh I guess it holds it all alright so we're gonna switch to this trailer we're gonna actually we could haul more grain in let's haul some different grains we might as well take a trip all the way up there and sell a whole bunch of grain so we'll fill this up with let's see what should we do we'll do some sunflowers because I think most of the prices are at port grain sunflowers port grain corn, pork grain, we won't do oats, but we'll get this all loaded up with some crazy different types of grain, try and get our bins empty and all that. Alright, so it looks like all we have left is wheat and oats for right now. We're going to go ahead and take this up to the pork grain if the old Kenworth can pull it. Um, we could probably leave the back hopper here, but yeah, let's go ahead and leave the back hopper. We'll go ahead and drop it off. Might have a little trouble hooking it up later. That'll be alright. Oh, fell on the ground. Darn. Anyway, we'll take this up to Central Grain. I don't think it'll sell up there. They said it doesn't. But I want to try it just to see because higher prices, better income, all that. And yeah, the Kenworth's going to be a little loaded coming up the hill. We'll see. And I don't know why, but I don't know if Nick plowed the road or if Moore did or if Brett did. Not entirely sure on that. But we kind of like planted the road. I don't know why they did that. Well, they plowed this whole area up because it's not actually a field. So you can't even see the road. But we don't have crop destruction turned on, so that's good. And there's grass on the road there. Don't know, not sure why. There's some more wheat and stuff on the road. But yeah, we're going to take this up to the top of the map, see if we can sell it, and go back to the pork grain and sell all this oddball stuff. That way we got our bins pretty empty so we can hold all these soybeans. Because I'm not sure how many times they've harvested or what they've all done, but I do know they have some. There's Spencer's Farm right there. They're doing sugar beets and potatoes, I think. Pretty sure that's what they're doing. So yeah, I'm gonna take this up there and we'll see you guys when I get up there. Okay, so we're rolling up here. We're actually gonna pull in backwards instead of driving in from the front. We're gonna go to the front hopper. Let's see what hopper we're on. We're on the back one. Go to the front. And I believe this fully total, I don't know what it holds. 60,000, you think? Fully loaded? Not sure. We'll drive up here and kind of floor it. Oh, we're gonna turn over so we don't hit. Looks like it doesn't unload. Let's hit I to make sure. Yeah, it doesn't work. Let's check the triggers. Yeah, there's no trigger to actually unload there. Or is there? There's one to unload right there. But I'm pretty sure we can't unload right there anyway. Doesn't look to be the right trigger. Or they might have forgot there's so many grain elevators on the map. Oh boy. Oh no. Alright, well we're going to go ahead and shut this off. There we go. Yeah, so I'm stuck now. We're going to go, what next? So then we have to go over here. I just hit my microphone. Then we got to go down this road. we got to go over. And we're going to go to the port grain elevator next. Get that. We'll end up going by Spencer's place there. And Squad's place. His place is like right in here somewhere. Or no, it's over here. I don't know. It's right here actually. I can see it. So we'll go ahead and get that done. Alright, so we made it to the port grain elevator. And looks like you can sell some wood here. Made it up with our soybeans. 
sunflowers and corn in the back of that hopper. And actually, did we get all the sunflowers? I don't think we did. I think we... I think we left them in that one trailer. The triple trailer. I think we actually had some sunflowers in there. But we'll pull up in here. I guess that'll be whatever. We'll just have to dump them back in the bin. Take them up. That's what I like about separate hoppers and stuff. Is because... Your separate hoppers you can hold in one of these trailers. One of these trailers. Oh, we got 34,000 off that. Off the front. So in one of these trailers you can hold... So much in the back, so much in the front. What I like about it is that you can do, um, what's it called? I'm thinking. So you can put a crop in here and a crop in here, but they can be different. They don't have to be the same, and then you can dump it. So you can basically haul all your crops to town in one semi, if you want. So, like, you can take... So right now you could haul four different crop types in this truck right now. The way we have it hooked up. Got 7,000 off the corn. Oh, we still have soybeans in that one trailer too. Get on the back hopper. Nope. Alright, 30,000 for the... That one. We got... 18 off the rest of the beans. Not not bad prices. Um, we'll go ahead and take out of here if we can. There we go. And there is that like box ramp that's on the port grain in Ravenport or Ravenport. There's that little jump thing there. Kind of want to try that out. Kind of want to you know do it and all. Jump it. But anyway, I think we're gonna take this home, start cutting some beans of our own, and. Yeah, that'll be over on my channel. That won't be on this one. And then the video for tomorrow won't be on the tournament. I'm going to kind of trade back and forth between tournament, the Rolling Hills map, and the tournament, the Rolling Hills map, and FS17. Probably not a lot of 17 videos just because it's hard to not necessarily record and edit it. That part's easy. But when you do with YouTube, you can't, like, set, you have to set it all back up for 17 and 19 have totally different pages, tags, titles, descriptions, stuff like that. I could probably keep the description the same. But anyway, hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, hit that like button. And if you want to go check out my channel, hit the card at the end or it's in the description. And we'll see you all in the next one.